I'd like to welcome you to the mount this morning, uh, where we exist to display the glory of God's grace in Jesus Christ by proclaiming him to all peoples for their everlasting joy in God. My name is Pastor George. I'm glad to be back worshiping with you after a few weeks in the New Mexico desert. Um, I'm going to bring you some announcements and some uh, notes, some guidelines. Uh, so first, in the way of announcements, uh, Sundays we have Word and Prayer at 9.40. If you missed, you already missed it this morning if you were not there, but it was a great time. Uh, we're currently looking through the book of Romans to, to guide our prayers, so definitely join us at 9.40. Uh, Wednesdays in July, the youth are meeting at 5.30 uh, to 7.45 in Six Mile for a time of swimming and Bible study. Um, you can contact the mans for that um, if you need a ride or need the address. Um, there's pizza and drinks and all that provided, so definitely if you're a youth, you want to be there. Uh, July 23rd and 30th, that's the remaining Saturdays of this month, join us for a church-wide book study of Before You Share Your Faith. That's 9.30 a.m. in the cafe. Also a great time um, of study. Uh, books are available and child care is provided. You can also see that uh, July 24th, the ladies of the church are invited to, a sh to shower the two brides-to-be, Rachel Nauer and Scarlett Harmon. Um, you can meet at Ellison Reed's home at 4 p.m. for a time of celebration. So that's July 24th, 4 p.m. And then finally for July, uh, the 31st is our, our summertime meal, uh, family meal for July. Uh, the potluck meal is right after our morning service and a wonderful opportunity for fellowship. There's a sign-up sheet in the cafe. You can also use the QR code that's on the sheet uh, to reach that. Um, if you are a visitor here, we'd love to have you fill out the Connect card. It should be in the seat in front of you in the, in the little pouch. Um, even if not, if you're a member and just want prayer, that's also great. We try to go over those and, and pray for you, so definitely let us know. Um, tithes and offerings are available here in the boxes front and back, as well as online, of course. And then finally, if you're a guest and don't know where the restrooms are, they're not in this building. They are through the door into the next building and to your left. And with that, I'm going to invite uh, for our call to worship. What have we got? It's Ellison. Excellent. And in preparation for that, will you stand for the reading of God's word? From Revelation 19, 11 through 16. Then I saw heaven opened, and behold, a white horse. The one sitting on it is called Faithful and True, and in righteousness he judges and makes war. His eyes are like a flame of fire, and on his head are many diadems, and he has a name written that no one knows but himself. He is clothed in a robe dipped in blood, and the name by which he is called is Word of God. And the armies of heaven, arrayed in fine linen, white and pure, were following him on white horses. From his mouth comes a sharp sword with which to strike down the nations, and he will rule them with a rod of iron. He will tread the winepress of the fury of the wrath of God, the Almighty, on his robe, and on his thigh he has a name written, King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Pray with me. Dear Lord, thank you for this time to praise you in worship and song. We are so thankful that we can gather together to worship and in fellowship glorifying you as faithful and true, the word of God made flesh, King of kings and Lord of lords, help us to wait expectantly for the day that the heavens will open in your triumphant return. We love you and are so thankful for you. In Jesus' name, amen. Remain standing as we sing together. 